Have you ever seen a baby duck follow its mother? Cats can act like that too, picking one special animal or person as their favorite. This chosen person is like their parent, providing safety and care. But how can you tell if you're that special someone for your cat? In this video, we'll share 14 signs that your cat sees you not just as their favorite human, but as their parent. Before we dive in, be sure to subscribe to our channel and join our feline loving community. Number 14. Sitting on your belongings. Have you ever walked into a room to find your cat comfortably nestled on your laptop or favorite sweater? While this may appear to be a simple quest for warmth or comfort, there's a deeper connection here. Cats are equipped with scent glands all over their bodies. These glands produce pheromones, which are unique chemical signals that cats use for communication. Cats deposit these pheromones on objects, or people, to mark their territory. So when your cat chooses to sit on your belongings, they're leaving their scent on your things, marking you as a part of their territory. Number 13. Nibbling. We might mistake gentle bites for a sign of irritation from your cat. But these gentle nibbles, often called love bites, are a unique way your cat expresses their affection towards you. Your cat isn't trying to hurt you, quite the opposite. These little nibbles are reminiscent of the way mother cats groom their kittens, using gentle nibbles to clean and soothe them. Main keyword here is gentle. A love bite shouldn't hurt. If it does, your cat might be signaling something else. Number 12. Exposing belly. This adorable behavior is actually not an invitation to rub their belly. In the wild, the belly is one of the most vulnerable parts of a cat's body. Exposing it means leaving vital organs unprotected, not something a cautious creature like a cat would generally do. Just as a child finds comfort and security in the presence of their parent, your cat feels safe with you. The belly exposure is a profound demonstration of their trust and love. They're literally putting their life in your hands. Number 11. Upright tail. In the world of cats, a tail held high is essentially their version of a friendly handshake. It's a cat's way of signaling friendly intentions and contentment. In the wild, cats use this tail posture to signal non-aggression to other cats. It's a display of trust and openness, something they only exhibit when they're comfortable and feel safe. So when your cat approaches you with their tail held high, they're signaling their trust and happiness towards you. But what about cats without tails, or those with shorter ones, like Manx cats or bobtails? Take a closer attention to the position of their ears. Ears pointed forward are showing you that your cat is relaxed and happy in your presence, a clear sign of affection. Number 10. Follows you around. In the wild, cats are solitary hunters, but they're also social animals when it comes to their families. If your cat is always nearby or follows you around, it's a sign they view you as a key part of their family. This behavior has its roots in kittenhood, when kittens follow their mother to explore the world safely. When your cat does this, it's not just about curiosity or companionship, it's about security and trust. To your cat, you're more than just their human, you're their protector and source of comfort. Number 9. Not afraid to show weakness. In the wild, showing any sign of weakness can make a cat vulnerable to predators, so they've developed a keen instinct to hide any discomfort or ailment. If your cat feels comfortable enough to let their guard down, for example if they limp or show you a wound, it means they trust you on a level that transcends their primal instincts. They're demonstrating a level of trust that only comes from a deep-seated sense of safety and assurance, akin to the bond between a parent and child. Number 8. Chattering. Traditionally, you might observe your cat chattering while gazing out a window at birds. This behavior is believed to be linked to their deep-seated hunting instincts, an echo of their wild ancestry. But when a cat chatters at a human, it's likely a different form of communication altogether. It's an expressive vocalization that goes beyond the typical meow you might be used to. Some experts believe that when cats chatter at their human companions, it's their attempt to mimic our speech and communicate on our terms. It's an endearing behavior that showcases your cat's comfort level around you, an attempt to bridge the language barrier between species. Number 7. Playfulness. In the wild, cats learn important survival skills through play. Kittens practice their hunting prowess by pouncing on each other, stalking their siblings, and darting about in mock fights. 
So when your feline friend engages in playful behavior with you, it's a significant display of trust and camaraderie. This interaction is a form of social bonding, much like a child playing a game with their parent. It's your cat's way of expressing their comfort and happiness in your presence. Number 6. Sleeping with you. Sleep is a vulnerable state for any creature, cats included. They instinctively seek out safe places for their slumber, where they can rest assured that no threat will catch them off guard. So if your cat chooses to sleep with you, they're not just choosing your warmth and companionship, they're expressing their deep-seated trust and love for you. It's akin to a child preferring to sleep in their parents' room during a thunderstorm, reassured by their presence. Number 5. Exposing Soft Undersides of Paws The soft underside of a cat's paw is a vulnerable area. Predators and environmental hazards can inflict serious injuries there. Therefore, a cat wouldn't expose this delicate region to just anyone. In the world of cats, trust is earned, not given. So if your feline friend freely exposes the underside of their paws to you, it's a major sign of trust. Number 4. Grooming. The act of grooming each other, known as allegrooming, is common among social animals, and cats are no exception. Cats groom each other to strengthen social bonds and express intimacy. So when your cat decides to groom you, it's their unique way of including you in their circle of trust, their feline family. Number 3. Eating nearby. Cats are solitary hunters, and eating time is when they're most vulnerable to attacks. For them, it's an instinctive behavior to seek a safe and secure place, where they can enjoy their catch without the fear of predators. If your cat starts eating when you are close, or even waits for you to be near to them before they eat, it's a massive sign that they see you as their protector. Number 2. Meowing. Here's an interesting fact that might surprise you, once they've grown out of the kitten stage, cats don't typically meow at each other. They've developed this form of communication to interact with humans. If your cat frequently meows at you, they're making an effort to communicate with you. It's their unique language, their attempt to connect with you and express their needs or feelings. Number 1. Brings you gifts. In the wild, cats bring back their kills to share with their colony, especially kittens and those who can't hunt for themselves. So when your cat leaves you a hunting present on your doorstep or at the foot of your bed, they're essentially showing care for you, in the best way they know how, providing food. They're sharing something they worked hard for, and are proud of. If you live with a cat, it's likely that you engage in behaviors that drive your cat nuts. Check out this video, where we talk about 10 human habits that cats hate and wish you wouldn't do. And be sure to subscribe to our channel and join our feline loving community.